welcome to my video today. I am doing another vlog updating on Landon's stock band. So we're going to a doctor's appointment to see how it's doing. He hasn't been wearing it all weekend because of the heat rash. So I am excited to see if they say if he can put it on or not again. Because uh, it's not red, but it's, it's still kind of rough and dry. So we'll see what they say. Right now I'm currently in the process of getting everyone ready. And I need to remember to feed everyone because do we block out if we don't eat? <laughs> the reality of having really long hair with kids is that no one actually does you have long hair because it always looks like this. Bring me your shoes. Thank you. Go grab all of her shoes. All shoes. Shoes. Thank you. Like it? <laughs> beautiful, beautiful. <laughs> oh well. Sam each for you. Sam each for you. And a sandwich for me. Why are my babies always doing this? What you doing? I'm eating chocolate. You gonna eat your sandwich? I'm giving her chocolate. <laughs> Hi, Mr. Bean. Did you just wake up? Yeah. Come on. No, the one above it. No, the one above it. Press Ellie. Push that. Over. Come on. No, you don't need to close the door, baby. You don't need to close the door. Come on. Follow. She's taking this very seriously. <laughs> I think it fits perfectly. to 
get too high because then it'll cause heat rash. So I just need to keep them in cooler clothing and then keep an eye on it for another day or two and it should be good. And if it's not, then I'll have to come back in and start over again. <laughs> No, 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 no. I'm very highly considering doing what that, like, remember that, like, meme post? Um, oh, that yeah. That has, like, the cardboard between the kids. Like, I'm serious. Like, I want to do it. <laughs> you can drink it out of a water bottle. You big? the number one dermatology blah 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 and then just randomly it was like are you still there <laughs> please stay on hold a representative will get with you shortly or something like that and i was like, scared me you <laughs> if you're still there just like the car keep on going even after you wake up <laughs> so i was like should i answer <laughs> And then all of a sudden it was like, press one for English. And then it started speaking a different language. And I was like, one, one, one. What are you doing? No, we're not getting out here, Squish. We're just going through the drives. So the reason I was calling, I feel like you're like, why you're talking to me. And then I'm not talking to you. No, I was just looking over. So the reason I was on that phone call. Alrighty. Anyway, so the reason that I was calling um, was for a dermatology appointment. Okay, so the reason I was calling um, the hospital was because Landon has a dermatology appointment on the 17th of this month. And we've been waiting for this appointment for about four months, so I had already forgotten the time, so I needed to call and be re-reminded because he actually has a granuloma, and it's kind of like this skin growth thing on his belly button. It sounds really, really gross. It doesn't actually look that bad. Um, so basically, when his umbilical cord stump fell off, uh, it was just sitting underneath it, and it won't come off. They're supposed to come off usually naturally, fall off, dry up, fall off in a couple weeks, but... It hasn't. They tried um, silver nitrate where they'll like burn it off. It doesn't hurt the baby, but that didn't work. So now he has an appointment with an actual dermatologist to see if we need, to, how we need to, or what we need to do to get it removed. So I'm gonna film that too. So if you care to see it. Anyway, so if you're interested in seeing that, I will be filming that too and letting you know how that goes. them what 
Ellie did at the appointment because there was another little girl there playing and they were running in and out of the rooms and Alex was, was following them, them, chasing them and telling them they couldn't go in the rooms. And then um, this other little girl went into the room that her parents were in with their her little sibling. And Ellie ran in after her and was like, no, don't go in here. Get out. And I was like. <laughs> but she was allowed in them. But she was allowed in them. Because she's allowed to go in places, but mm -hmm. no one else. So. Mm-hmm. They'll never see us again. That's <laughs> true. Uh, the, the workers playing peekaboo with the babies in the back seat. <laughs> That's cute. You can move. Thanks. Distracted driver. Yep. In, a whole, in the drive through. Okay. You never know. You can still hit someone in a drive through. Yeah, but not if you're really moving, you can. I mean, they could get mad and ram into you. Is that what? Uh, no, thank you. Salt. That was super awkward, honestly, because, um, I didn't have the salt out, so I wandered around like an idiot, Aww. like in circles, and then I asked the person at the register for salt, and then she looked at me like, I was like, do you have salt? And then she looked at me like I was an idiot. And then pulled out this like bucket that had the salt and pepper in it. So one of these is a pepper. I don't even want that. So we just got back from the appointment. We grabbed some food for the drive-thru. And um, I'm probably just gonna clean up and let the kids play out on my patio. So I'm just gonna end the vlog here because that probably won't be that interesting to watch me clean. So that's all for today. Bye. Please.